All right, this is the new iRobot Home app, and it comes with the Roomba 980. We're really excited. The Roomba has always had the clean button front and center for over a decade. And to make things simple for the app, we also borrowed that clean button, and we have it right here. And wherever you are in the world, whether it's your at home or on the road, you can start a cleaning or set a schedule or control your robot. So a couple of neat features I want to show. One is scheduling. So we've made scheduling dead simple by incorporating into the app versus on our older robots we used to have the buttons on there. So we put all the buttons right here in a familiar way so that it makes it very easy for users to set the schedule for the robot that they want. Another thing is that the Roomba 980 has new features such as carpet boost. So we've taken our most capable robot, we made it really intuitive by taking those features and explaining them in here and allowing people to change the preferences that they may have for the specific cleaning. So if you've had a big party, maybe you want two cleaning passes the next time you clean, and we make it all very intuitive here. And if you're uncomfortable with what you did with the changes, you can always just restore it back to the factory defaults. Under here, we have a couple other features too. We have care, so if you're a first time purchaser of a robotic floor cleaner vacuum, we explain sort of the basic maintenance and we show you with step-by-step -step guides that actually come from our customer support team um, right here online to just walk you through maybe the first time you need to change the bin and how does that work. So that's really cool. All these things advance based on the robot runtime and tell you when you might need to maintain something. We also have a whole lifetime history of all the cleaning jobs the robots perform, the total time, the total area clean, and how does the dirt detect um, sensors been activated to run into a persistent pass to really clean some uh, a special pile of dirt or so. We have recent job history, which goes through all the recent missions that it's run, and you can go in and see how long the job was, how many square foot it covered, and did it detect any dirt that set off the persistent pass behavior. So customers can come in here and just see did it perform its job, did it cover uh, the whole home, and for how long. Also, in, um, here in settings, you get to rename your robot. This one was renamed to Roswell Jr., thanks to Collins Robot Roswell. And we also note in here that you have robot updates. So at iRobot, we're always improving the robot software. We find little things that we can make better, and we incorporate that software into the production line for new robots that we make. In this case, for robots that are connected, we actually can share those updates with all those robots. So if you purchase a robot already, your robot will get better when it receives those updates from the internet. So that's an overview of the iRobot Home app.